Oh, this one I could recreate. I could recreate this. I could pull it off. I think I could pull it off. Hey guys, it's Marie too. I hope this video finds you well. I hope you're doing great. I hope you're doing awesome. Today, I decided to recreate Pinterest outfits. So that's why we're not in my office or anywhere else. We're in my bedroom because it would have been way too complicated to bring all of the clothing pieces downstairs because my office is downstairs. So now we're in my bedroom. We're getting all cozy up in here. I will pick up different outfits from my Pinterest inspos from my mood board and I will try very, very hard to recreate them with what I have. I'm just excited. I have always wanted to do this. I just told myself, you know what, just do it. Even though it doesn't look like, you know, what it's supposed to look like, it'll be fun. So without further ado, let's hop into the video. Wait, 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 wait. Before we hop into the video, do not forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to put on your ring bell notification, which will notify you every single time I post, which is every Wednesday. So now, without further ado, let's hop into the video. Okay guys, so now I have my laptop, I'm on Pinterest, and I will search for outfits that I could recreate, and we'll go from there, and then, and then I will search in my wardrobe, and then I will do a little lookbook for you. Okay, so I am uh, um, gonna scroll down my outfit ideas. Oh, I like this one. I have a blazer, I have a white top, I have baggy-ish jeans, and I have Air Forces. So this one, I'm gonna keep. So what can I do next? And you see, this is the thing, is because I always have a mood board for clothes that I don't have yet, um, clothes that I aspire to buy. So I might not have every single piece of clothing that I uh, want to recreate anything with, but I will try and we'll see how it goes. This is a simple look. I could pull it off. Do we even have a graphic tee, a white graphic tee? No, but I can use another graphic tee. So I'll take this one. Don't you just love like Pinterest? It's just so perfect. Like there's no drama, there's no nothing. You don't have to prove anything to anyone. It's just like you, your creativity and what you like and like you just pin it. It's just like a, a journal of beautiful aesthetics. It's amazing. Oh, this one I could recreate. Yeah, I'll, I could recreate this one. So I'm gonna take this and then this, I have the black top, so I could, you know, do something. I don't have like black trousers, but I could, you know, find something that fits and just like recreate this. So I am, I think I could pull it off. Oh, this looks kind of good. I could recreate a certain type of thing like this little look so I'm gonna save it I could recreate this in a very different but still cute way I could recreate this oh I can do as well this little version with a um, blazer instead of a leather jacket so this might be something that I could recreate as well so I'm gonna keep this okay so I have my little outfits and now I'm going to search in my closet to see what I can come up with okay so for the first outfit I will need a white type of blazer a white crop top or bralette and baggy jeans and for shoes, I will need the Air Force Ones that we all know. So I have my rolling rack and I will start searching. So the first thing is the white top. So I have a white camisole. I have kind of options, but this one is like high neck. 
and I could like roll it up, but it's a deep v-neck, so it wouldn't really be representative or of what it is. I'll go with this top and I'll just, you know, roll it up. Okay, and then for the jeans, I will take, I have two choices. I have this wash and this wash. This pair of jeans is my favorite, but I feel like they're not really that much baggy. They're just, you know, mom jeans. And this one is a little bit more baggy, but at the same time, it's not even that baggy. So I'll probably take this one. I only have one white blazer, so it won't be difficult. So I have the white blazer. I'm gonna put it right here. Okay, so I have my first outfit. Now I'm gonna have to find the pieces for the second outfit. So this one is easy. It's longer shorts with a graphic tee and long white socks and white shoes. So I have my long shorts here. I have it in black as well, but I think I'm gonna take the light wash. I'll take my loyal Aaliyah t-shirt. This t-shirt is huge, so like, I could wear it as a dress low-key, but not really because I'm super tall. The third outfit is a white top with, you know, the little structured bra thingy, and then a leather jacket, brown leather jacket, which I have. If you haven't seen my thrift shopping in my birthday vlog, I'll put it right up here. And then beige pants. And I'll just, you know, beige pants. I have my white top. This top that I have with the structured thingy. I have the brown leather jacket. I think this one will be the one that will look the most like the picture. And then I'm gonna have to take beige pants. I don't really have the shade, it has in the picture but i will try i have these pants are like cream i have these pants which are the same from um the other baggy pants but in beige these ones you're probably like oh my god this girl folds her clothes so badly but you know what it's only good vibes here it's only good vibes we don't care i might take the, these ones i'm not sure I'll take these ones and if it looks hideous, I'll just change it, okay? The hanger is gonna fall apart, so I'm just gonna put it, mm, I'm just gonna put it aside, okay? I'm gonna put it aside because the hanger is gonna fall apart. Now I have this little set. It's black, it's all black. The base of it is black long pants with sneakers, black sneakers, and a little black bag and a open back tee. I have the open back tee, but it's in the wash, so I'll take it when it gets out. And I don't have like, you know, high-waisted straight leg pants that are black, but I have, you know, kind of pants that look like it. I'm gonna take, oh, I could take my leather pants. I know it gives another vibe, but I could take my leather pants. Or I have these pants, but they're, kind of low-waisted i don't know if that's what they were going for and it's kind of form-fitting so i'm not sure either about that but we'll take both of them and we'll see and the little bag i'll take one of my mother's bag you know from the 90s for the next look i have a small mini mini dress actually chunky boots a little black bag and a leather jacket on top i think i will reuse my brown leather jacket and then i'll just you know switch it up with the little mini dress so i'm gonna take this little dress this little piece here in love with it i love the pattern it's everything so i'll take this with the leather jacket okay the next outfit is leather pants like cognac colored leather pants and then a little cropped polo and sneakers and a little bag so i have 
I think we all know my wardrobe by, by now. It's like seriously. I have these pants. They're from Aritzia. But I always, I always show them. So I'm gonna take these pants. And since I don't really have a light colored crop polo, I just, I thought that this brown one would look cute. It's a little bit of a, you know, brown on brown. Or I have, I have this white one with this top so it might look cute okay and then the final final look i have a oversized blazer with a mini dress and chunky boots so this one i have a blazer that I also thrifted from my last vlog so i'm gonna use it i have it with me right now the tag is still on literally the tag is still on but um yeah so i'm gonna take this one and with a mini dress i have another dress for you guys i have another dress for you guys it's a little bit the same style from the other one but it's all black and it crisscrosses in the back those dresses are everything like they're my dresses okay i love them so much and yeah so i think i found everything so i'm gonna see you in the next clip when i try them on and see if it's actually cute or if i failed all right guys so this is what i came up with for the first outfit if you think it looks like another day it's because it is another day okay let's not talk about this but here's the first look i feel like i kind of killed it for the first look at least love it so i tucked the tank in my bra uh don't mind the kind of wrinkly uh blazer <laughs> but um yeah both of them are from dynamite this pair of jeans is from zara and then the shoes air force ones so this is the first look what you guys think in comparison to the pinterest one doesn't it look like a little bit similar so what would you rate this one? I feel like the outfit is really, really cute. I should get like an actual crop top, but you know what? You just do it what you have, and I think that I killed it. So yeah, but I would give this a solid nine out of 10. Okay, next little look. This is what it looks like. I love this. I love this. It looks like I just threw clothes on and just left the house, but it still looks cute, you know? The t-shirt, like I said, is extra long. Like, it hides the whole fit. But you know what? It's kind of cute, though. <laughs> so I would definitely, definitely wear this outfit. I'm just, you know, I just, I just, but I just love it. Yeah, I would definitely wear this and yeah so this is from winners so i mean tj maxx anywhere you could find graphic tees they have the best graphic tees and they're like ten dollars so i would really recommend you to go there and then long shorts from zara and then white shoes <laughs> white dirty shoes and white socks so this is the look this is the second look i would give this a 9 out of 10 as well don't at me <laughs> I love this. Okay, next look. <laughs> next up, we have this outfit. I wasn't sure about the pants, but you know what? It's not that bad. It has the little top and the little jacket and everything from the photo. So I kind of like this as well. I feel like I'm killing this challenge. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie. I would probably still change the pants uh, for something else if I had anything else but um for for now it's cute this is from it's thrifted this is from the bay the bay canada <laughs> and this is from zara and the same white shoes okay guys you gotta acknowledge the commitment i even did the hairstyle so this is what it looks like from the back it pretty much looks accurate to the photo kind of like it actually i'm not gonna lie <laughs> kind of like it it gives a 90s vibe that i <laughs> truly truly love it's so cute actually what the hell i should get colorful shoes so that there's like 
pop of color it would look uh, so cute but i love this outfit oh my god i'm surprised the pants would have looked prettier i feel like if they were maybe a little more baggy but as just like a pant that is similar it fits perfectly it's just so cute oh my god i can't stop looking at myself okay bye <laughs> but yeah this is a 9 out of 10. I'm gonna give my outfits 9 out of 10s everywhere, every single time. Shit! The top is actually a little bit too big, but I like tightened it because it's adjustable, so it's fine. And the pants are from Veramoda, so that's fine. I got it for $5. That speaks volumes about how much it cost to do the pants, probably like two cents. But anyways, um, yeah, super cute, love this. And the bag is my mother's. Okay, so the next look is this one with the leather jacket and the mini, mini, mini dress. I literally pulled the strings so far up my legs just for it to look as mini as it could, so. This is a little look. I actually love this. It's so like edgy, but still cute. I would give this a swallowed 8 out of 10. Probably like an 8.5, actually a 9, never mind. I'm trying to be diverse here, but you know what? I'm just gonna say how it is. But yeah, I really, really love this. So let me talk about the deeds. The best thrifted, of course, the dress, Aritzia, and the boots, Zara. So, with three articles, three, <laughs> you can just, you know, pull a very cute outfit. I truly, truly, truly think that I would wear this if I could go anywhere, <laughs> for that matter. Grocery shopping, doing anything, anything. Okay guys, so I kind of cheated with this one. I switched dresses. I thought that it would look prettier with this type of dress. So this is the second look, a little variation of the other one. I am in love. Are you surprised? I am in love. Um, the boots are the same and the difference is the blazer, of course, the biggest difference. It is thrifted as well. And this dress is from Lulu's. I kind of like pulled it up a little bit because it's a little bit longer, but all in all, it's still kind of small. So this is the look. Ah, I'm obsessed, I am obsessed, I am obsessed. I would give this a nine out of 10. What do you think? What do you think? This is great. <laughs> Comment down below which outfit you like the most which one would you wear and if you're liking this video so far don't forget to like this video and just you know subscribe for more videos like this so let's go to the next outfit so this is the last outfit it's probably the most different from the picture but it still looks cute kind of like the fact that they complement each other the the top and the bottom even though they're basically browns um and the shoes they're a bit, i could have changed the shoes but i don't have any other shoes i would have probably taken shoes that have like a little pop of brown as well so that it would you know match with the color scheme but it's still kind of cute i'm gonna try it with the white top and tell you what i think about it okay so this is with the white top i think that it looks better with this one like in comparison to the picture but both of them are really cute but i think that this one looks more like the picture uh the first top comes from zara and this one is from american eagle but i just cropped it it's a normal length polo but i just cropped it because you know and the pants y'all know i i won't even say it i won't even say it it's fine <laughs> so this is the look i would give this a 8.5 out of 10 because the top could have been better but it still looks mad cute i would wear this and yeah so i'm really proud of myself i have a great score 
for this challenge. I have a great score. I can't even, you can't even argue with me. This was a good one. Okay, bye. So this was my video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you liked it. And please comment down below, which outfit was your favorite? Cause I know, I know you liked them fits. I know you did, I know you did. And tell me what video you would like to see next as well. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it and subscribe to my channel for more fashion and lifestyle and vlogging, everything in between. Put on your ring bell notification too. With that said, I'm not gonna hold you any longer. Thank you and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.